uh, we've been doing research now for over three years. Um, it's something as a practice we're always looking to bring develop new services. Um, we're a big team, we're the largest practice in South Manchester with over 16,000 patients. Uh, we have a very large um, different demographic of patients, different age groups, ethnicities, different disease prevalences. Um, and being the largest practice, we have a lot of doctors which we can share expertise out with. Um, so it's great to be able to just give a few different doctors, myself included, different projects to get involved with, um, research being one of them. Um, so it not only benefits the practice, but also our patient population. Um, patients seem to love it, it gives them different choices about sort of managing their disease. They, they seem really excited, a lot of them, to be involved in uh, cutting edge research, which might make real differences for future options for patients. Well, um, we've got fantastic premises. We have over 20 consulting rooms, one of which is a designated research room. Um, so that's all well stocked with a refrigerated centrifuge, temperature controlled and monitored freezer and fridges. Uh, we also have a designated research nurse, all our staff are GCP trained. Uh, the other thing we're doing is we actively try and upskill as many doctors in research as possible. Those that are interested, which is the majority, um, just so the different doctors then can lead on different areas. Um, we have a doctor who's got a postgraduate diploma in diabetes, so she's very keen on the diabetic studies. She works um, as a GP with a special interest in secondary care, doing diabetes as well. Um, I have another doctor who's PI on studies who has lots of obstetric and gynaecology experience, and she actually won GP of the Year award once, um, and the practice has won lots of other awards um, for, for setting different services, so we have a good track record uh, here for excellence. Another point is we have never missed a recruitment to time and target objective uh, in any of the studies we've, we've been involved in. Uh, we've also been the first to recruit globally for one of the studies on the first primary care site to recruit um, for a commercial study recently. The other thing to mention is, um, I mentioned that we've got fantastic facilities but also we have really good um, access for patients in terms of car parking. We have over 200 car park spaces. Um, outside which are free to use, so it's not like having to park in a hospital where you've got different charges. Um, we're also located on the busiest bus route in Europe, believe it or not, um, up Wilmslow Road. And the biggest, another big selling factor is uh, patients know us and trust us. So if we talk to them about a study, we already have that, um, we already have that rapport with them and, and the trust, which can definitely help recruitment.